So in this video, we want to talk about what's really behind varicose veins. Why do certain people get them? Well, there's a common thread. Um, you'll see them in pregnancy, uh, menopause, obesity. When you take birth control pills, that's one of the side effects. HRT, hormone replacement therapy. Um, what is the common thread? It's estrogen. I want to show you some uh, interesting research. High endogenous estradiol, and by the way, endogenous means made within. In other words, it's estrogen that is coming from within. Your body's making it. Is associated with increased venous distensibility and clinical evidence of varicose veins in menopausal women. The veins actually get distended. They balloon out. They get twisted when you expose them to too much estrogen. Now, let's talk about how your body can make more estrogen. There's an enzyme called aromatase in your body. It's in the adrenal glands, it's in the ovary, it's in the breast tissue, and it's also in your fat. And what this enzyme will do, it'll take testosterone that's in your body and convert it to estrogen. So one of the challenges people have is if they have too much fat, they're an estrogen machine. Their own fat is making this estrogen, and that potentially could start creating problems with your veins. All right, so what can we do about this, okay? Number one, you can stop getting pregnant so often. What is it at? What are you at, nine kids now? I'm being totally sarcastic, okay? Um, it's okay to be pregnant, okay? Have as many kids as you want. All right, so with obesity, just realize the less fat you have in your body, the less estrogen dominant you're gonna be. So you wanna do the healthy version of keto and intermittent fasting, and that should be very effective, okay? But there are things you can do to inhibit this enzyme along the way. And you guessed it, cruciferous vegetables, like kale, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, cabbage, are aromatase inhibitors, okay? There's also a concentrated version of cruciferous called DIM. It's just more powerful. Garlic will also work as well. The other thing that you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to start an intense exercise program and really work on that because the veins are the return blood flow from the extremity back up to the heart. And you wanna stimulate the blood flow coming back to the heart. Um, a lot of times when people sit for many, many years and they don't get enough physical activity, they will get this problem in the veins. So you can actually undo this over a period of Time. It might take a few years, but you want to include regular intense exercise to do it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Hey guys, real quick, I have a new healthy keto eating plan for you. Just go to drberg.com. It's right on the front page. I put a link down below. Download it, it's free. Check it out.